Today I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on using Garmin Map Install. I have a Garmin GPS Map 62S with an SD card in it plugged into my computer here. When you first start up Map Install, this is the first screen you're going to see when you're on a Mac. If you see your unit listed here, you're ready to go forward, so let's hit continue. You won't be able to use the continue button if you don't have a device plugged in. So right now, on the left hand side here, it's telling me what I have installed. So I have a partial install, approximately 200 megabytes, of Topo US 24K Southwest. I also have Topo Canada V4 partial install. I can use this drop down menu over here. I could leave it as is, or I could remove it, or do a full install. I could also remove the Topo Canada or do a full install. I don't have enough memory on the device to do a full install. So if I select it, you'll see that it goes red and I'm over by, looks like 100 megabytes. So let's go leave as is. And let's look at advanced and partial install. So if we click on the advanced partial install button, it's going to take us to a different screen where we could actually select which map tiles we put on our GPS. Right now, you'll see I have Southern BC and Southern Alberta going on. I'm using a Mac, so if you use the Command button, hold it down, then click and drag, it's going to unselect those maps. If you just click and drag, it'll select them again. So let's uh, change the area a bit. We'll install Northern Alberta BC to the card too. So it's going to create a new map set and put it on the card. You could even choose your other maps here. Just use the drop down menu. I have Topo US 24K Southwest West installed. So if I go into here, I could choose some new map tiles. I'm going to try by unselecting them. So hold down command click and drag, and all those are unselected. Down at the bottom here, it's going to tell us how much free space we have how many, and how much we've used, and then how many maps we have selected. So we have 199 total maps selected, 63 of those are Topo US, and then the rest are Topo Canada. You could zoom in and out using the left-hand side here. Zoom in. And as you zoom in, you'll see the different detail. And then you could zoom out. You could pan the map by using these arrows. You could even search for a city if you want to load maps from around that city. Select the maps that you want and then select search for city. So we'll go, let's try Calgary. So here we are, brought up Calgary for us, so we can make sure that map set is selected, which it is, you can tell by the color. Now that we have the map selected, let's send them to our GPS. So we have the Send Maps button in the bottom here, so we'll use it. Once everything's good, just confirm and the software is going to install to your GPS. Of course, once you're done, be sure to verify the maps went over by checking your map screen and the map setup. That was a quick introduction to using Garmin Map Install.